Have you ever wanted an electric vehicle but wished you could simply remove a flat battery and swap it for a full one like your old Nokia? Well, you're in luck because Blue Shark has launched its R1 scooter in Malaysia, complete with a unique battery swap system. Here's everything you need to know. The Blue Shark R1 is available in two variants, starting with the R1 Lite, priced at 7,190 ringgit. The regular R1 is quite a bit more expensive, costing 9,390 ringgit. Those figures include only the bike, without the batteries. You'll have to rent them at 79 ringgit a month. The real benefit of the R1 is that you can go to a swap station and simply trade your depleted batteries for fully charged ones but that will cost you 59 ringgit per month. For that, you get 36 swaps every month. If you do more mileage and need to change your batteries more frequently, you need to pay 99 ringgit per month for up to 70 swaps, or 139 ringgit per month for up to 120 swaps. Alternatively, you can simply pay 1 ringgit 95 cent for each swap. Blue Shark is also targeting commercial buyers, which is why it's offering rentals of the R1 at RM487 per month for the light model and RM547 per month for the regular R1. This includes the battery rental, so you don't have to worry about paying extra, although you do still need to subscribe to the swap service if you want. Oh, and in case you're wondering, yes, you'll only need the B2 license to ride it. The R1 itself is a fairly standard electric scooter, targeted at delivery riders and slightly more affluent commuters. A single electric motor produces just 5 kilowatts or 6.7 horsepower, but it's been geared towards providing more low-end torque. In fact, it makes 201 Nm of the stuff, almost matching the Aura Good Cat. As such, even though the R1 only has a top speed of 80 km per hour, it will get from 0 to 50 km per hour in just 4.9 seconds. You can choose from 4 ride modes, Eco, Normal, Sport, and a turbo mode for maximum performance. <clears throat> the R1's two batteries have a total capacity of 2.88 kilowatts, providing a claimed range of 110 kilometers, although its real-world range is probably closer to 80 kilometers. To charge the batteries, you can either plug up the bike itself or you can take out the batteries and place it on a dedicated charging station. Yes, you can ride the bike with only one battery. Charging both batteries will take 2.5 hours from 0 to 80% and 3.5 hours for a full charge. You can, of course, simply swap a flat battery for a fully charged one. It can do so at any of the blue stations in the Klang Valley. However, there are only four of these locations available, located at the Petrona stations at Batu Tiga along the Federal Highway, Section 13 in Shah Alam, USJ6 in Subajaya and Desamantari in Petaling Jaya. That's not a lot, but Blue Shark Malaysia says it has plans to grow its Blue Station network exponentially over the coming years. Hmm, we'll see about that. The rest of the bike is actually pretty cool. You get LED head and tail lights and disc brakes at the front and rear. There are also seven colors to choose from, including white, black, blue, green, gold, brown, and even pink. The differences between the regular and light model are mainly down to the tech on board. The standard bike has a 10.4-inch full-color display that runs on Blue Shark's Arkwright operating system, with Bluetooth connectivity and even loudspeakers for playing your music. You even get a virtual vroom feature that makes your electric scooter sound like it runs on petrol. You'll also find cruise control, a USB-A and USB-C port, a two-person seat and a helmet storage compartment underneath. You get none of that with the R1 Lite, just a monochrome LCD instrument cluster, a single seat and a rack at the back for installing accessories like a storage box. Both R1 models come with a walking assist mode that provides some electrical assistance when walking the bike forwards or backwards. On the full-fat R1, you even get reverse sensors and a rear-view camera. So that's everything you need to know about the Blue Shark R1. What do you think? Is this the future of urban mobility? And does the idea of swappable batteries actually interest you? Let us know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and ring the notifications bell icon so you don't miss any of our future videos. As always, stay awesome. I'll see you in the next one. Ciao!